Well, I'm officially back and I'm going to be reviewing the Grand Theft Auto 6 trailer 1 as well as trailer 2. Now you may be thinking, well hang on, Rockstar has only released one trailer. You'd be correct. There is a second trailer which admittedly is fake, but it actually, in my opinion, almost surpasses the original Grand Theft Auto 6 trailer that was just released. So we're going to be reviewing both of these trailers and literally talking about some of the gameplay, some of the things that we see. Uh, yes, I have seen this trailer, both trailers, like 10 times. Fucking love it. I'm not going to pretend and say, oh, look at this. Look at this. It's so cool. I've never... I've seen it. Okay, I've seen it 10 times. I'm obsessed with the trailer and the second trailer as well, which is kind of awesome as well. Uh, if that sounds exciting, guys, no feel free to give us a like and subscribe. Yes, I've been away for a little while, dealing with things in life. Didn't really want to do anything regarding this, but I'm back for the moment. Let's just have some fun for this situation. Now, Grand Theft Auto uh, 6 Trailer 1. This is officially Rockstar Games. Currently has 74 million views from 17 hours ago. Remember that number, 74 million, 17 hours ago. If we go back in time, the Grand Theft Auto 5 trailer from 12 years ago has 98 million. 12 years, 98 million, 17 hours, 74 million. So obviously this game when it comes out is gonna be the biggest fucking event in gaming history. This is just gonna blow absolutely fucking everything out of the water and I'm so excited for it. I'm a huge fan of the PlayStation 2 uh, Vice City. Huge. Even Grand Theft Auto 3 Vice City. I even like the New York City one as well. What was that? Like 4? Grand Theft Auto 4. It's really unappreciated GTA 4. I really, really liked it. But anyway, let's watch trailer one together. I've obviously seen it 10 times. Let's watch it. Here we go. Lucia, do you know why you're here? Bad luck, I guess. She's super cute, by the way, 100%. The graphics are just incredible, hey? They really are. Fucking incredible. I love the trailer. Uh, let's talk about the time span. So look, obviously, obviously Vice City, when it came out on PlayStation 2, was set in the 80s, I'm pretty sure. I remember listening to the radio station constantly in the cars that are steel, obviously. Who would buy a car? Well, you, you could buy a car. You know, I probably did buy a car. I probably bought many cars, but I stole a lot of good cars as well. The radio station... The radio stations in, in Vice City on PlayStation 2 was incredible. Uh, so much, so, so much of the old classic 80s hits were, were in, that, uh, in, that, in that game, including that one from, um, oh, what's that Al Pacino movie, Scarface. Uh, I can't remember the song name, but the, the, the song from Scarface is in that, in that game. Fucking love that game, uh, the music too. So obviously that was 80s. This is gonna be a current situation. Uh, now, in that trailer, we saw, you know, current vibes. We're getting people with social media, social metering on, on their... Is that even a word? Social metering? I don't even, I don't even know. Social, social metering. 
they, they're basically on their phones, right? Live streaming and, or, or, or taking videos of certain things, right? And we'll just quickly have a look at that again. I'm going to take a couple of uh, pausing situations on certain moments. So here, for example, you can see uh, Stay Alert VC Vice City. Remember to check for uninvited guests before the pool party. So, I mean, this seems to be some sort of social media usage, right? Someone called the Department of Transport on this dump truck. <laughs> the, 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 the thing won't go away so we can read it properly. But anyway, let's just, let's just ignore that. So obviously, this is the social media age, right? This is... Uh, you know, people are getting hearts. These two girls are getting hearts, right? This is a modern time game, which is probably good, actually, because you could incorporate everything from the past into the future and everything from the future into, into the current, right? So I think with this new game, and we will watch trailer two in a second, I think with this new game when it comes out, I mean, it's going to have obviously amazing graphics. It's probably going to be utilizing... Uh, in my personal opinion, I think they may end up using AI software to incorporate current things that are happening in our world, possibly into the Vice City world. It's just a theory of mine. Obviously, 2023 is undoubtedly the year of the beginning of AI. Hate it or love it. It's, it's a thing that's happening, right? Uh, as Elon Musk said the other day, the genie of AI is well and truly poking its head out of the bottle right it's 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 almost out there it's sticking his head out right so i think i think ai and grand theft auto vice i almost said vice city grand theft auto 6 will be a bit of a you know situation like that that's just my theory now i want to show you guys the other trailer if i can get out of this and and have a look at this one now it's actually from this youtuber tom tom iconic tom iconic i'm gonna let my computer read that one too mechanic. Too mechanic. There we go. He's got 50k subscribers, and this is his GTA trailer. If you would like to watch it with me, okay, let's watch it together. Why did we move here? I guess it was the weather. The golden sun just beaming down. You know, like in the movies. Except this is not a movie buddy we have. This is Vice City. A place that has become the hotspot for everything grand. From incredible locations and luxury sites down to the interesting... Characters? Sure. Very interesting ones. Great song. He did an incredible job. Have a look at this, by the way. Keep looking, keep looking, keep looking. 2024. So when this video came out, he didn't realize that GTA at 6 would be coming out in 2025. Hence why he has on there 2024, because he guessed it would be the next year. Uh, so as of recording this, it came out this, the 5th of December and only has 3,050 views, which in my opinion, at some point, this video should blow up. It looks genuine. Look, I, I watched this second trailer, the fake second trailer on my Facebook. Some media company posted it and said, oh, look, here comes another trailer from Rockstar. I watched it not on widescreen, but the, the normal Facebook format, you know, that shitty little... Anyway, I watched it on, on that, right? I watched the trailer like three or four times on Facebook. I was shocked. I was like, what? Fucking hell. Rockstar have just released two trailers on the same day. Couldn't believe it until I did some more research and found out that this was just a fake. A fucking great looking fake. It's so interesting. What do you guys think about that? Now, we will be reading some of the comments because why the fuck not? Uh, Grand Theft Auto 6 trailer 1. This is from the official Rockstar account. Let's see what some people are saying. We've waited 10 years for this moment and it's finally here. Absolutely. It's been a long time. 
Uh, it really has. Now, seeing Vice City again brings memories that can't be described. It transports us to a whole uh, new world and time. Nostalgia hits hard. Absolutely. I still remember when I was five years old and I had a pile of papers with GTA San Andreas codes written on them. Now I'm 20. Damn. It was one of the first games that, uh, that many of us started to play and now we're witnessing to this legendary moment abso fucking lootly 75 million in 17 hours is crazy it shows how much anticipated and iconic the series is absolutely a, a minute of silence in honor of all our loyal fans who didn't live to see this legendary moment jesus christ that hits differently absolutely wow there would be a lot of gamers out there who unfortunately passed away for whatever reason who wanted to see not only the trailer for GTA 6 but obviously wanted to play it uh, wow it's hit. thinking about that it, it hits differently that though that's a very sad situation to think about 100% I remember when I was 11 when this came out when what came out now that I'm 21 it feels like I haven't played played it yesterday as a kid good times what's that mean I don't know uh, the 10 years we've been waiting really shows incredible visuals. Can't wait to play the game. Very, very cool. Look, what do you guys think about this? Is this trailer dropping your jaw on the floor? Or is it a bit of a meh? Let me know down in the comments below. I hope to see you for the next video. We make videos about technology, games, unboxing reviews, shit like that. Not too sure what I'm doing with my hands, but uh, I'll see you for the next one. Hope you liked the video. See ya.